New at six, a Cranston Home Nursing Agency is accused of overbilling the government. And now it's, it's stuck in neutral. We're talking about St. Jude Home Care, which serves about 1,000 patients. NBC 10's Brian Crandall is live in Cranston now. With more on that tonight. Brian. Gene, the owner of St. Jude Home Care here on Reservoir Avenue, is fighting those allegations. And meanwhile, she's open but basically can't provide any services right now, and that's leaving hundreds of patients and workers scrambling. Again, the owner tells me that an official at the State Office of Health and Human Services has done her wrong, that he has a vendetta against the business, that she didn't do anything wrong. An official at Health and Human Services told me, on condition of anonymity, because the person wasn't authorized to speak to the media, that St. Jude was suspected of overbilling Medicaid, that the company's paperwork was suspect. And that information was then passed on to federal officials who apparently pulled St. Jude's certification to bill Medicaid. If a business can't bill for the work and can't get reimbursed, they can't do the work. So the owner says her 300 employees will have to hit the unemployment line and about 1,000 patients will need to find new care from another agency. And again, she claims she did not overbill and that she's been wronged. He took it upon himself to be judge and jury without asking us any questions, without having a trial, a hearing, without him ever having called me. He made up his mind that we were guilty of fraud and he stopped us from being able to build the Medicaid program and publicly announced that we were under the suspicion of fraud, which means that no health, other health insurance will deal with us. Now she claims she has the paperwork to prove that she didn't do anything wrong and she says she's hired lawyers and that this will go to court. But again, St. Jude Home Health Care in Cranston, about a thousand patients will have to find alternative care and workers will be on unemployment. I'm Brian Crandall, NBC 10 News, live in Cranston.